Hey no, we're in Springfield, Massachusetts today, and we're gonna go into the Emerson White Playground and Park. This is a very old park from 1908, and it has a South End Community Center next to it, and it's a new playground set for young kids out there. It's on 77 Marble Street if you want to visit. Anything you want to know today? So is this part of the Bill family parks? Yeah, well the Bill family from 1906 onwards uh, donated land for five parks. And this is one of the Emily White, White Emerson. The Emerson White is also the Ruth Elizabeth Park and then the Nathan Bill Park, then the Gurdon Bill Park and the Emily Bill Park. There's five of them total. So you got a lot of choices to go and see what this family did. They made this one in 1908, so it's a very old park, but it's the second oldest of the bills, because the first one was 1906. So let's go see what they have in order for us. You can check out the area. All right, and you can see that it has, it looks like a spray park, a uh, basketball, um, yeah, basketball court, playground area for small kids and big kids. And then a baseball field down there. And then it has a community center to the side of it. All right, and you can visit any one of these that you want to. And Marlboro's a residential street near the end of south end of Springfield. And it looks like they just refurbished this park. The mayor has been trying to get money for a, a lot of different parks around the area. Okay, we're coming to the main entrance itself, so check this out. Yes, welcome to Emerson White Park, and it's spelled W-I-G-H-T. Alright, and Marble Street's here. And it's at the edge of a uh, woods, and so on the far end you got a lot of beautiful trees. There's a beautiful oak tree right here. I'm sorry, that's a maple tree. All right. So this kind of park is a walk around park, and it looks like it has two entrances. Uh, this is the major entrance, but other streets around look like they have gateways coming in too. And they have a very unique bike rack, and they have the spray park, probably only usable during the summer. And the community center looks gorgeous. It's big. It probably is run by uh, the city government, but I'm not sure. It might also get private funds. Okay, so I'm gonna do some walking on the grass to show you around some more and by other entrances there looks to be one in the far end there you have a little circle and place to park and walk in and there also is one down this end so there's two more besides this marble street and this looks like a softball field and looks like the biggest they'll make Right, and what I'll do for you now is a 360 to show you the area. Okay, I'll do one more small loop for you.
you this is what I mean by it has two circles coming in this is one of them the other one's over there and you can come off uh, one of the side streets here no parking inside the circle but you can park out on the road and then come into the park from these areas here so it's a nice little place plenty of benches and with that outdoor community area in the very back of the community center this really is a large place to visit okay and with that make sure you check out the page it has much my page for this a park to have much more for you thank you